This is Mount Trebevich, which overlooks Sarajevo with such a paternal vigilance that the 480,000 inhabitants of the city below have come to know it almost as a member of their families. It is the site of an $8.5 million combined artificial bobsled and luge run. And the competition that will take place here today is the finals of the two-man bobsleds. Push bar really threw off his concentration. He's way back in 18th place. The heavy snow has made the course treacherous. Della Hunty is a good driver, fine pilot, the British national champion. Of course, Great Britain won the gold medal in bobsledding in 1964. Tony Nash, Robin Dixon probably won the greatest upset in the history of two-man bobsled at the Innsbruck Olympics there. 21-24 split, 21-15 on the left, the best time. Pretty good line. Della Hunty driving a pretty good course. There's his split time out of seven. 33 considerably off the pace, 33.75, 65 miles an hour here. Now 200 degrees to the left change in the big Omega corner. Real Omega. Now into nine, now into elaborate. Three is going to scan it. Delahunty's over. We don't see the driver. The sled has been right. Sled's back up. Delahunty looks hurt. He looks unconscious. He's bouncing around. The ride counts because they finished intact. Hello everyone, we are out here in Sarajevo, I don't know how to pronounce it, but we're in Bosnia. We came across the 1984 Winter Olympic bobsled track, so we're gonna mob it. As you can see, this is where like the starting beginning is. This is where they run with the bobsled and jump onto it and try not to fall. This track is super, super steep and it's super populated with people right now, so we're gonna get our best shot at mobbing down it. There's a lot of people on it right now, so we're gonna shred what we can of it. Bobbin. We're cooking, Will. Oh yeah, it's way less sketchy. We came here yesterday and it was really wet, but now it's dry and it's actually really sick. Did you actually blend into the wall right now with your jacket? I'm trying to match to my natural environment. It's like you're wearing camouflage. This one handed is probably the sketchiest thing I've ever done. Woo! And this is the finish line. You didn't quite make it, Will. I got some shoe though. Oh, you want to really mob it? Yeah. Here we go. As you probably think, this is a traditional skate park vert berm thing, like skater cross if you've ever been to it. But no, this was built in 1984, so it's really bumpy. When we're down right here, it's really bumpy, and where is one? There's these cracks. This one specifically is filled in, but as you can tell, they're they're not they're not small. So when you're coming around these turns, this one's fine. 
but it'll catch your wheel. And on the first drop we did, I'll try to see if you can even see, but my hand almost blew off. Like I hit it and went boom. And then I had to like grab it and I almost ate it. So it's a little sketch, but I mean, I'll give it to him for 1984. Pretty good. Also what Clayton was saying, like these berms aren't your traditional quarter pipes. So if you look at it, like this is like a, a nice, like two foot quarter pipe and then it goes to just a wall and then it goes to another like oververt. So as much as you'd wanna believe that it's just a perfect quarter pipe, you can just like chill on the wall. It's really, really intimidating to stay on it. Plus when you're riding down, the scariest thing that can happen is you can be riding and your wheel can like catch you and start pulling you up. I've never experienced that ever in scootering before, but this is a this is a first. Like on one on one of the ones going down, I, I was I was mobbing and I was riding up on the wall and then for some reason my wheel was just like eek. And then luckily I was able to come back down, but it gets really scary. It happened to both of us too, so it gets sketch. It gets real sketch. Hi, we're gonna send it again. What's up? See what happened? No. I was uh, on one of those turns, did you see when I was like this? Yeah. My front wheel was like up on the wall like this. That's, that's what happened to me. Remember I told you the first time? I was like, did you, when you were riding out with the camera, I was like, did you see me almost die? Yeah, that's that, when I almost died that, that's, exact, that's exactly what happened is my front that's wheel the, caught the wall ride. Yeah, that's the sketchiest part. I couldn't get it off of it too. Time to full send. I'm only about a third of the way up, so why not go too fast, but my goal is to not put my foot down at all because this thing is steep. So full send. Oh my gosh, it may not look scary to you guys. I don't know what it's gonna look like, but my eyes are watering. We're up in the mountains. It's crazy. It's also beautiful. And we full sent it. This one is for America and farts. drops have we done? I don't know. All right, take number something. Action.
how this goes uphill, so we just stop. Gang, bro!